anything because it's not my toodles. Hey, toodles. I'm making a quick, fast, and easy lunch, or you can make it a dinner or a lunch, and I'm going to show you what I'm doing. So I'm going to get the ingredients I'm using and show you everything that I am doing. I am making a macaroni salad. We have more different, I'll show you. You see me, the light, a different lighting in here that my husband put in here. So some spots when I move around, it's going to be dark because of the lighting. But one of the things that I use to make my macaroni salad is a half a box of this, unless you're making it for the whole family. Now, if you're making it for the whole family, then use the whole box. I'm just making enough so I have some for lunch today. I've had made some when I worked. Um, I was making it and I was taking some for me and the ladies at work. And the ladies I worked with loved it and they thought it was awesome. So I'm boiling my noodles right now and I'm going to turn the fire off because I think they're done. So my noodles now coming into here it doesn't really matter what you get you can get the cherry tomatoes or you can get if I can get this package to shut you can get the grape tomatoes or the cherry tomatoes and I'm using grape tomatoes you'll also need a red onion so I'm using half a red onion not a whole red onion like I said if you're making it for the whole family then you'll use the whole red onion and probably the whole thing of these. Now, for these cherry tomatoes, since the uh, grape tomatoes and they're big, I used four, five of them. If they're the small ones, I use about six. I've got a bell pepper here, half of a bell pepper I use. Now, not a lot of people like bell pepper. I like bell pepper. So, there's my bell pepper and my tomato chopped up. And there's my onions chopped up. So, I'm going to go ahead and put my cherry, my cherry, well, not cherry, but grape tomatoes in here as well. And these seeds, if you take these seeds and put them in a napkin and dry them, you'll grow tomatoes. So, now I'm going to take my bell pepper and put my bell pepper in here as well. And then I'll get, drain my noodles in and put my noodles in there. Now, for seasonings, when I'm cooking my noodles, I cook it with sea salt. Sea salt is better. Sea salt is healthier for you. It is good for you. Sea salt is. So, I do use sea salt in my food. And I cooked my noodles with the sea salt. So, my noodles are done tasting them. They're good with the sea salt. I also like to use garlic pepper. I like to sprinkle, not a bunch, but a little bit of garlic pepper. So, when you are doing the seasonings, I just go like this and sprinkle it a couple of times to give it a little flavor. I love my Italian seasoning. I use Italian seasoning every time I cook. Now, when I make my regular salad, lettuce salad, and I make my macaroni salad, or any salad I make, I always use the McCormick uh, Pitch Perfect Sutton Salad, or salad, I'm so, sorry, salad supreme um seasoning and there's a little bit in here as you can tell i use it so that was something i had put down on the grocery list i had to get next time we go shopping so let's get over here i'm going to get my strainer here and if you want one of these and you like the one that i have it is by tupperware so um for some of y'all that know me on my channel i used to sell mary k avon and tupperware and i do not sell that no more because I was not making enough money selling that. So, and I have people trying to get me in Avon Tupperware and Mary Kay um, Facebook groups. But every time I decline, so. Ouch. That was a hot fight. I'm trying to get the noodles out of here. So, I got my noodles. And yes, they're steamy. Oh, my if you see a little fuzz, it's because it's steamy. So I'm going to take my noodles and put them in the bowl with the mixed vegetables that I put in there. The spoon that I use to cook the noodles with and scoop them out. I have no way of setting my phone. 
So I'm going to take and, and do this. Now, I do use a salad dressing in here, and I'm fixing to get that out of the fridge. I forgot to get it out, but I do use a salad dressing in here. But before I put the salad dressing, I'm going to go ahead and show you all the seasoning. I'm using this seasoning here first. So I just go like this and sprinkle some. Let's get the next seasoning is my Italian seasoning. And I'm going to get that sprinkle little Italian seasoning in it. I'm a little Italian, but not a lot. I have a little bit of Italian in me, but my husband's more Italian than I am. I can't even get the lid off the next seasoning is the garlic pepper and just sprinkle a little bit of garlic pepper it gives it that little pepper flavor um a couple things that you can do um you can cut up a, a lemon or a lime and you can put like lemon or lime in there my last thing i put in here is i just added just like one, two spritz of the sea salt. Let's get over here to the fridge. Now I do have a lemon and you can add lemon. So I'm gonna get this lemon out of here. And I've also seen people where they have add baby spinach leaves with the salad. As for me, before I mix it up with the seasoning, I'm going to put a little bit of rice with mine. I made some brown rice the other night with dinner. And I don't have much, but I'm going to take this spoon that I did the noodles with. I'm trying. I got a bone in one hand. So I'm going to take this spoon. And I'm going to scoop about that much and sprinkle some rice with it. And just add a little bit of rice on it. I've seen people add grits with this that I have made. Um, I made. I got the recipe out of a magazine, and I thought it was, like, brilliant. And ever since I made it, my stepdaughter has loved it, but she's never tried it with the rice. Now, for the lemon, I'm going to have to set you up for a second so I can cut this lemon. Cut this lemon in half, like so, and there's seeds. So, I definitely, I had a lemon tree growing in the backyard because my big dog passed away. And my stepdaughter decided to unbury the lemon tree and use the dirt. So, I'm going to cut this lemon again because I know my husband's going to use this lemon. This lemon is actually, kind of looks like it's going bad. So, I'm going to put this in front so you can see. And I'm going to squeeze this lemon right on top of this. Give it that little lemony flavor. And the other pieces of lemon, when I get done, I will clean up my mess and put it in there. Now, I'm going to do this. I'm going to switch. I know it's kind of dark. You can barely see me, but I use this seasoning, Italian seasoning. It's, um, you can use Wishbone. This is Zesty Robustero Italian seasoning. And I'm going to, like, put it and mix it up with my, oh, it feels like I got a piece of glass or something in my foot. I'll squeeze some there. And now I'm going to take and mix this up again. And I usually add more dressing to it. And then I will take a noodle or something. And you can, if you, raw vegetables are not bad for you. They're pretty good. So I'm going to take one of these noodles because these are stuck. <laughs> that is so good. <laughs> That is so good. That is so perfect. And that is how you make a macaroni salad that I make. It is warm, so you don't want to serve it to your customers. And you don't want to serve it to your people warm. You want to make sure that it is cold when they eat it. 
If they want to warm it up, that's their business later on. But right now, I'll give it to them like that. I hope y'all enjoyed this quick, quick macaroni salad video. Until next time, guys. I love y'all and hope you have a blessed day today. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell to be notified of more videos. Because I will be doing... I did have a channel called Cooking with Toodles. I do not use that channel no more. I want to delete that channel, but do not know how to do that. When I figure it out, I will, because I don't really don't want to use that channel. But I want to make videos like this and put it on my channel. I want my channel not just to be about makeup, but cooking, makeup, and other stuff. So, I also have another video coming up soon. But I'm working on getting a camera again. So, I can use the camera and not my phone all the time. So, until next time, guys, I love you and bye.